What's up guys, in this video we're going to be unboxing and doing an on the fee of the new Jordan 1 Low SE in the black iced lilac colorway. I purchased these sneakers February 10th for a retail price of $120 from DTLR. Having said that, let's get right into it. All right guys, these come in that special black on black Jordan box that we've been seeing on certain SE models of lows and mids, but let's go ahead and check out the size sticker. Here you'll see the official name as the Air Jordan 1 Low SE in the black slash iced lilac white colorway. So let's go ahead and open these right up. The first thing you'll see is some white tissue paper and bam, here they are guys, the Jordan 1 Low black lilac. All right guys, I want to jump in here real quick to remind you guys to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already i'm gonna be making more dope sneaker reviews so go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you are into these type of videos but let's go to check out all the details this sneaker has to offer starting with the midsole we have your typical jordan one midsole in all white and when it comes to the outsole we have a beautiful gray translucent outsole very good looking as always and when it comes to the uppers the majority of the sneaker is black however we do have some gray which which really make the shoe pop but let's go and take a closer look starting at the front of the shoe surrounding the toe box we have some all black leather and the leather quality does feel a lot softer than when you normally get on a jordan when low we have some more of that black leather on the quarter panel up the shoelace holes on the ankle area down to the heel and even at the very center of the shoe surrounding the swoosh talking about the swoosh we do have a very good looking gray swoosh in a soft new buck material which which does stand out a ton on the sneaker since the majority of the uppers are black. Moving on to the back of the shoe, you'll notice the Air Jordan Wings logo stitched in gray on black leather. And just above that, we do get a small rectangular piece of black leather connecting the two swishes together. Moving on to the inside of the shoe, it is identical to the outside, so we'll go ahead and move straight on into the toe box. The toe box is in a very nice light gray color and it is in that same new buck material, which feels very soft and smooth when touching it. These come with black laces and it is the only pair of laces these come with. We get a black nylon tongue bordered in gray and at the top we do have a gray jump man stitched into it. The sock liner is in light gray while the insole is in black with a white jump man in it and a size sticker. The inside of the tongue is in a very soft puffy light gray color and these sneakers were manufactured from September 14th through November 16th. But now we're we're gonna go ahead and put both shoes side by side give you guys different angles and lighting so you know exactly what you're getting if you do decide to go ahead and purchase these sneakers all right guys here they are the jordan one low in the black iced lilac colorway all this footage is completely unedited so what you see is what you'll get this is such a simple yet very attractive looking sneaker that's for sure but let's go ahead and put them on feet and see what they really look like when wearing them All right guys, overall, this is a great looking pair of Jordan 1 Lows. The colorway is fantastic in my opinion. You can wear these with basically any outfit. The colors go so well together. The translucent outsole looks amazing. Overall, it's just a great choice for anyone looking for a solid pair of Jordan 1 Lows. But having said that, if you enjoyed the video, please smash the like button. It really does help out a lot. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.